Let's get started. I'm so excited. Hey guys, I made an egg prop out of newspaper. This project has taken me two weeks to complete. Now I'm going to share with you how I do this paper mache, what I use and what you need to look out as a baby prop. <laughs> everyone, Sissy from Just Kitty Photography Studio. Today I've got a machine. I am planning to make a paper mache out of newspaper. So this prop, I'm not sure if this is going to make to my YouTube channel. Um, it's totally just um, an experiment. It's my first paper mache. I'm going to make it for the coming Easter photo shoot as a prop. Like I'm going to make an egg for the baby to sit in. Right, so I have collected the newspaper first and glue it's PVA glue if you guys are watching it this becomes a tutorial PVA wood glue now I'm gonna cut these newspapers into strips now the mode which is the balloon it's called confetti balloon I don't know what that means it's the biggest balloon I can find on the market it only cost me two dollars unfortunately um, as I go along I just realized that the size of this balloon is way too big I think it might be too big especially after the paper mache of my first model came out as a failure I just realized I have to buy another balloon but if you blow it up halfway through it becomes a round shape it loses the egg shape completely now this time my balloon is a lot smaller than that see the size difference previously it was i think too big and also i've got a prop that i use for newborn photo shoot i'm eyeballing the size is roughly my seated size so I place it on top of that and looks at and apparently the balloon is an okay size. Um, the balloon I'm using today is a 16 inch. Hopefully 16 inch is the right size for my series. This time I add a bit of water into my glue. The last time I used 100% glue which turned out to be very hard to apply. And I also think the purpose of you putting water into your glue is so that it becomes flowy. Um, and the newspaper, it would be easy to apply um, and it could stick to the balloon more properly. So water is very vital. The ratio of my adhesive is about three parts of glue and one part of water. Now only for copy paper. Once I've done the first layer as newspaper, the second layer I use A4 white copy paper. So it gives a white effect and also I think more layers means more durability. I didn't wait my newspaper layer to be 100% dry then apply the second layer. I think I did in the same day. Okay, so it's been hanging in my studio for over three days. At the moment I'm 100% sure it's dry. Hear the sound popping onto the floor, and it's very firm. Can't even press in. But the finish is um, can be improved. I bought a pack of plaster of Paris. I don't know why it's called plaster of Paris. I'm going to cover the outside of this shell. Egg shell it looks like a pear at the moment. <laughs> um, hopefully this is gonna work. Now I'm gonna press the bottom in so that it can sit nicely on the floor. Take a deep breath. It's not gonna be firm enough to sit a baby in. It's already pretty good as the way it is. Plaster of Paris. Pour the edge nicely so it gives a broken egg finish. Again, another experiment. I'm going to be easy on myself. I just add a tiny bit of water. I wanted to make it like clay. Maybe not clay, like mud. I don't even know if I'm doing it 
the right way. First time for the Morning guys, take a look. Ta da I think it turned out to be very successful. It's very sturdy. You can see it's very hard. No way a baby could damage that. However, I need to um, polish the edges a little bit and also to smooth out the surface a little bit. Yeah. inside of my egg. I'm not too worried about the outside. Here's the acrylic paint I bought from Dollar Shop to $2.50. Um, it's called Renault Art Acrylic Paint 100ml. The colour is antique white rather than white white. It looks a bit too yellow to me so I'm mixing up with some white paint. I used a second balloon to make a smaller paper mache as another piece for the baby's head. I think it went quite well, but the size might be a little bit too big for the babies. That's okay. It's not a hat. It's just going to be sitting on baby's top of the hat and be like that. Very casual. Now it's time to style my setup. So I used two pieces of PVC boards underneath and um, some foam around the boards so that it reflects the light. And then I placed the egg and the chickens on, all the props are in, and ready for the baby to shoot. So my model is arriving soon. He's about one year old, 12 months. Uh, I think he would be able to sit up properly in the egg. Not too sure how stable he can keep. Let's get started, I'm so excited. you guys have enjoyed my video remember to hit the like and subscribe button i'll see you again in the next video